let me encourage you right now. And I want for you to think about this. Now watch this. What God is telling you to do, the devil is going to fight you either way. Now, I need for you to hear me, y'all. See, what God is telling you to do, you can either give up, throw in a towel and stop, or you can press through the pressure and the resistance and continue to fight this fight the good fight of faith that you're standing upon, believing him for, to enter into that miracle. Because sooner or later, that breakthrough is going to come, especially when God's word and an assignment that he has you on, oh, you're going to see prevail and you're going to see and you're going to get to it. But here's what I want you to think about. Either way, whether you press through or give up, He's not going to come. He's not going to stop coming, y'all. He's not going to give up on. He's not going to give up on coming at you. So you might as well just press through. You might as well endure and persevere and go after where he's leading you, what he's calling you to do and go after the blessing. Go after that prize and go after what it is he's telling you to do. Because whether you go through and you get to victory, because you already are in victory, but if you get the victory in this thing that he's telling you to do, or if you surrender and stop and allow him to stop you, either way, he's still going to keep coming. He's not going to give up on you. He's not going to stop trying to take licks on you. He's not going to back up off of you. So you might as well just press through, Endure the pain, endure the pressure, and let that pressure be your fuel. Let that pressure be the thing that presses you through so that on the other side of this, Jesus Christ gets the glory. Because you know like I know, sometimes if we had it our way, we want to do it with smooth sailing and with no resistance, and we want to do it with no friction. But a lot of times you know, and if you walk through this long enough, it don't, come, it don't happen like that. You're going to take some hits along the way. You're going, to pers you're going to have to persevere along the way. You're going to have doubts. You're going to have fears. They're going to arise. And that's normal. That's natural. But you got to take those thoughts captive. You got to suppress those things and not allow those things to be the dictating and the leading of your life. You got to stand true to his word upon you and over your life of what he's calling you to do. Go and do what it is. That the blessing awaits your arrival in. Don't let nothing stop you. Don't let nothing stop you. Because I promise you brothers and sisters. I'd much rather him fight me. As I'm pressing towards. Rather than me surrendering. And stepping back. And not even heading towards where it is he's calling me to be. Because either way. He's coming y'all. Either way he, he's not going to give up on you man. He, he's not going to stop coming. But how about you beat him by God's glory coming upon your life as you get to seeing the breakthrough on the other side of this. Because the souls that are await, the miracles that are going to happen, the experiences and the victories that you're going to see because you chose not to throw in a towel and you chose not to give up because on that other side is victory. Don't stop. It's too late now. Keep going.